Hey you guys, it's Apostle Michelle. I hope you guys are having a beautiful day. All right, so I'm on here for a quick moment. The Lord wanted me to um, pray for you guys. He said pray um, to uh, for you to be removed from the enemy's trap. So um, I, I don't know if this is for everyone, but he said specifically to pray that. And um, I was supposed to jump on earlier this morning for our live communion. And so you guys, I have been going and going. Um, as you can see, I got um, some things in the back um, on my way to my dad's house. He lives in another city, so I am taking him his things. So what I'm planning is once I get finished running all over the place, I'm gonna jump on later on today and we can do our live communion, okay? Um, but um, I wanted to go ahead and um, pray for you guys. So, um, something I did want to say, like I was saying, with this uh, trap um, that the enemy has, um, I don't know if you guys remember, but I shared this a couple of times that whenever I was a brand new Christian, um, I heard uh, the Lord say to me, the audible voice of God, I've heard the audible voice of the Lord, like, a, a few times like I mean it's, it's been uh, several times I've actually heard audible like just loud you know and so I remember hearing his voice this time he said uh, when I was a brand new Christian I don't know maybe a couple of months in a few months in being a Christian um, not really sure how long but I remember hearing him say that if I was to backslide, um, uh, that if I was to backslide, that the enemy had a trap for me. If I was to backslide, the trap was that he was going to kill me. So that, that was the trap. So I didn't backslide. I have never backslided. <laughs> And that was, I was a brand new Christian. And so that's what I heard the Lord say. So that was a trap that the enemy had for me. And so the Lord wanted me to pray. I don't know what type of trap that the enemy has set up for you guys, or if you're already in the trap, but the Lord wanted me to pray that you be removed from the trap. So he's going to remove you from that trap. Okay. Whatever it is, it could be finances. It could be your relationships. It could be something that could be with your health. Um, it could be the ministry that you're called to. It could be your ministry that you're already in. It could be anything. So I want to go ahead and pray for you guys now. Okay. So, okay. I'm in my lane. I'm getting off on this exit. So let me make sure. <laughs> All right. Heavenly Father, bless your holy name, Lord. Heavenly Father, Lord, I ask that every person, Father, that is watching this video that the enemy has a trap for them or if they are already in the trap heavenly father I ask that you remove them from the trap of the enemy heavenly father in jesus name and heavenly father if there is a trap that is planned for them in the future i ask that that trap that plan the plan of the enemy also be revealed to them heavenly father in a dream uh, audible voice father through a prophet um, that they see something that I ask that the plans of the enemy whatever trap the enemy might have for them Father I ask that to be revealed to your people in Jesus name Heavenly Father okay so I'm feeling definitely like something is happening you guys so I don't know if you're feeling anything <laughs> You're being removed from the trap. And if I am in traps, I'm being removed from the traps. <laughs> um, but yes, that is what the Lord wanted me to pray for you guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of this day. And hopefully some of you guys might jump on and join us for communion. And if you haven't actually jumped on and joined us for communion, I try to do communion um, Saturday mornings around 1030 uh, Eastern and um, that time may switch up but right now I'm enjoying doing communion in, in the mornings 
I didn't want to go to the evenings, but um, after a long day, you know, especially if you have a lot of stuff to do, you may be too exhausted. In the morning, we're kind of fresh. We can do communion with the Lord, and we can start our whole day out in God's presence, you know? So, Saturdays, um, 10.30, that's the time that I kind of have set, but like I said, the time can kind of change. But if you would like to join us, make sure you bring your uh, cup and your bread and some type of oil or something that you can um, anoint yourself with and join us. All right, you guys. So I'll go ahead and let you go. And um, I'll talk, talk with you guys later. Bye.